So, enough blabbing. Let's play some Genshin. Man, wouldn't that be sad? Me saying I'm gonna go co-op and only like nobody or like one person can show up. <laughs> That's fine. You know, it's perfectly fine. Um, that would be a bit sad. Also, yes, my Spotify wrapped. I posted it in Discord. If you're not in my Discord yet, please join. Uh, and if you are and you haven't posted your Spotify wrapped, I totally forgot that I listened to Karia so much. Uh, but I did. <laughs> so that is my top song of the year. <laughs> I, I genuinely thought I listened to King Gizzard a lot more than I listened to Karia, but I forgot how ups upset I was, uh, obsessed I was with that song. Also, I listen to songs on repeat. It's ridiculous. Um, yeah. But I'm not upset with my, my top five. They're good. It really shows what I listen to. I honestly really like Spotify Wrapped. I cannot, like, I, it's one of the things I look forward to so much. <laughs> <sighs> okay, we are doing Mona's story quest. We are already in Leeway. We made sure that we got there. Um, so, all pog. All pog. Damn it. Did I mute the game? No, the game is not is unmuted. Huh. I would share my recap, but I don't use Spotify. That's okay, Bear. But you can still like sort of figure out what your your top five was, maybe. I don't know. I always like to see what people listen to. You said my style of music was completely different from yours. I'm actually here for a stream. <gasps> Root, how are you? It's been so long. Welcome. How are you doing? Hope you've been well. Hope Misty's well. We are playing Mona's story quest. Um, and then we're gonna do Baiju's if I have enough time or energy. It's always the energy. It's not the time. It's the energy. <laughs> um, but yeah. Uh, also, yesterday I was doing chores, like laundry and dishes and stuff, and because people posted their Spotify wrapped, and like, uh, two of you, I think it was Hira and who else was it? Was it you? Was it Queen Sea Fairy? Um, or was it Evie? It was Evie. I was like, Hoyo Mix, wait a minute. <laughs> So I went to listen to it. So I listened. <laughs> I listened to uh to to Leeway soundtrack while I was folding laundry. <laughs> it was actually really really nice and chill, because it's very hard to find nice background music just without too much. Like I love listening to K-pop, but I keep my door open um, because I. I have a CO2 meter in my room now. I can't show it because the the cable is too short. I have a CO2 meter because because I'm so tired. I was like, let's just check if like it's the CO2 that is like too high or whatever. Um but I keep my door open when I don't want to have the window open or both just to air out the room. Um, and then, like, I can't be blasting music, first of all, um, and I can't be blasting K-pop. Plus, it's just nice sometimes to have, like, really chill music. So, thank you for letting me know what is actually actual um, Genshin music. Um, and then another one, my friend Cherise. Uh, I bumped into it because, you know, on Discord you can set when you're... Um, 
that people can listen to what you're listening to. I have that too. So <laughs> you can, a lot of the time in my Discord, you can click on my name and then it shows what I'm listening to on Spotify if I'm listening to something. Uh, but she had that too. And it was like this... Um, this lo-fi lo classical music. And I'm like, what? And then when I was hanging out in her room, it was also playing. And it was great. So I looked that up and I added that to my playlist too. I was listening to that as well. Lo-fi classical collection. Perfect. Because it's still classical, but like... Slightly modernized and I like it. Uh, just ordered lunch. Ooh. Right. Time zones. I had dinner. I made cabbage. <laughs> I love cabbage so much. I made it yesterday. Uh, soon they're gonna release a new album with the character demo songs. <gasps> really? I haven't heard them. I still haven't watched the character demos. Maybe we should do that on my last stream before um, on my last stream of the year. Thing is, I don't really listen to some unusual music very often. When I show someone what I listen to, they will say they like it too. But of the time when they are sharing what they like the most, it's music I don't at all. Different tastes in music. Ah, uh, that makes sense. That makes sense. I am very shy about sharing my music because I know it isn't very cookie cutter. Uh, you know. Like, I don't listen to Taylor Swift and stuff like that. Not, I'm not saying that that is like the... But I feel like... Yeah. I, it's it's okay. My, music, my taste in music is okay. But still, I'm very shy about sharing music. Mm. So, yeah. <laughs> but... Eh, I shouldn't be so shy and... and and scared of it. People just like different types of music and that's okay. Uh, that's a good idea. I think so too. It will be fun. And maybe I will see... No. Look. I will be leaving... Um, in how many? In like two weeks and a half? Something like that. Yeah. In like two weeks and a half. And then I come back on the 31st. But that's like, it's going to be New Year's. And I'm going to be tired. So at first I was like, oh, maybe I'll do a stream. But I'm by the time I'm home, I'm going to be really tired. And I just want to rest. So I will just, I will see. I also just want to go watch the fireworks here. <laughs> um, so yeah, basically on the 17th, it'll be my last stream of the year. Yeah. How are you doing, Classic? Hi. I'll listen to Taylor if she's on the radio, but I won't seek her out. Same. Maybe if I'm like, how does that song go again? Uh, I'll. But I won't seek her out either. If like Spotify is very good with creating playlists, I should listen to them more so I'm more in the loop with like songs. Because I don't know nothing about current music. Um, but yeah, I'm the same. I'm not shy at all, but I don't want to spam different songs in the chat. Eh. You can post in Discord like your top five of the songs that you think you listened to this year. If you can finish up all story quests that come before Sumero, you can probably watch all demo trailers from before Sumero. That's what I'm going to try to do. I think we can do it. We have... Including this one, we have eight streams left. So we're not counting today then. Well, we do. We, we're going to try to do both of them. Sunday, we'll do co-op. Um, so let's say we have six streams left. Six streams and... I forgot already. I think it was five. One, two, three, four, five. And five story quests. We'll be fine. I think we'll be fine. <laughs> I'll have to do one per stream. And if they're not, like, five hours long, I think we'll be fine. 
Hi, monkey D boy. How are you doing? It has been a while. That's true. How have you been? What have you been up to? And no worries that it's been a while. Real life happens. It's totally cool. Sorry quests are really not that long. It depends if I keep talking to you guys. <laughs> Remember Hoot House? <laughs> I spent ages talking to you guys. Though I'm pretty sure that you all don't mind so much. Should we teleport there? Because it's right at the teleport point. Might as well. Also, we're still raising money for charity. Let me point out again that, you know, I'm raising money for Save the Children for their Gaming Tuesday campaign. My goal is 1,500. We are 310-ish dollars away. Um, I do, I'm keeping it low key, um, but I do have, no, wait, please hurt. Um, uh, I do have small incentives uh, for $10. If you donate $10, I will do a little doodle in my sketchbook. So far I did two, which is fine. Uh, I would like to do more. Uh, for $25. I will put a small to medium tattoo, temporary tattoo, so like something like this. This counts as medium. Um, on myself for 50 um, dollars, it'll be a big one. So far there's three big ones like this that will be put on me and the position I let you guys choose, but so far nobody has picked the position, so I will pick them. Um, but basically for $25, it's small to medium tattoos, and you can pick a space um, just like below the neck if you donate 50. Um, a big one, or a small to medium one, and then the neck becomes <laughs> available for you all. Or if it's a really small one, behind the ear. Uh, and that's, that's what we have. Um... I had put my original goal was a thousand, but then I got a really generous uh, drop by Elgado. Um, and for a thousand, I was going to do a room tour for you all and upload it on YouTube. Uh, because I think you guys might enjoy that. Like seeing what is actually, you only see like this little square. And you kind of see what's, what's behind me, but like to really see it more. Plus, I I think it was eight years ago I uploaded a room tour. I I privated it um but for the people that have potentially seen that uh it's gonna be a massive upgrade from what it was which is nice it's nice for me to see how much things changed in eight years i know there's a bed in the tv that's all there's a lot more i think i once like picked up the, the webcam and showed a little bit but like i also have a couch technically you can see the couch like here this 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 is a couch this 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 thing this is a oh i love this let me just show you the blanket i'm sorry i'll show you oops i dropped something you didn't hear it because it's hanging on a cable but it dropped let me put it This is like, uh, this is like folded in half and in half again. It's massive. This, basically this, four times, you know? Um, <laughs> it's a blanket that... My aunt crocheted for me. Uh, she crocheted it fully for me. And one day I just got a package from her. Um, so, yeah, I was very pleasantly surprised. It's just really massive. 
I love that the TV is in front of the bed. I would be gaming while chilling there. That's what I do in the evening sometimes. Um, like on my Switch. Or like I attach a laptop with like an HDMI cable. Or like I watch stuff. That's how I watch stuff. Or like I have like a Google Chromecast. Um, but I also have... Like, I'll attach a laptop to it through an HDMI cable. That's what I do. Um, yeah. Monsieur. Oh, thank you. I was traveling this week to see your mother. That's nice. I'll be traveling soon to see my mom, too. It's a really cool. Can't imagine how long it would take to make if I was the one crocheting. She, honestly, the funny thing is... Um, she, <laughs> I have like, we have a family WhatsApp group, like, um, my mom's in there, my brother, my stepdad, um, uncle, aunt, cousin, niece, grandma, I think that's it. My other uncle used to be in there as well. So we have like this, and she was like posting pictures of that. She was crocheting like these little squares and I'm like, damn, that's going to look so cool. So I knew she was working on it. She worked like, oh, so much. The thing is, my aunt can crochet very fast and without looking. So she just puts the TV on and she does this. She doesn't even have to look at it sometimes to see, but um, it's crazy. So she was doing that. And then I got it in the mail and I was like, oh, you were making that for me? <laughs> she made two. Because she started making this for me, and then uh, my little niece, who is her who is her granddaughter, was like, I also want one. So she had to make two. I think she worked like a couple, like, couple of months on it. So, yeah. She was like, I had to take a rest, because her wrist. I wish to buy a handheld console one day. I was the same. I wanted a Switch for so, so long. But I had like my, my, um, I had my 3DS, so I was, I was good, you know, uh, but then three of my friends, um, pitched in together and they got me one for my 30th birthday. There, I said my age. It's not my age. It is my age, but <laughs> for my 30th birthday. And I cried like a little baby. Uh, a lot of people can add. It's so cool. I cannot. I'm also kind of slow with it. I can't either. I'm really slow with it too. Um, I'm also not good at it. I'm better at knitting. I love knitting. I haven't done it in a while. I haven't done it since I made my scarf. Uh, and that's been like a couple of years already. Um... I also like embroidering. I haven't done that in a while. And cross-stitching is also really great. Ugh, I also like drawing, but I don't do it as much because, you know, I'm not that good. And then I get demotivated. So then you don't draw, but then you also don't get better. So Dana, just do it. Anyway, um... <laughs> It's like it grounded for a whole day, but it's way worth it because the fish tastes so good. We need to keep going if I want to do two story quests in one day. Let's see if I can offer something. No, I already wait. Was it one? If it's one, I'm gonna be so upset. Oh. Damn it. <laughs> It's okay, we'll find one. Teleportation. Don't want really want Switch, but some those handles I could play bigger games on, including Genshin. Ah, one of those, like this the Steam Deck and stuff like that. It's interesting. It's so heavy. But I don't I think I'm okay without it. I think the Switch is is perfect for me. Um and like, I'll play computer games on the computer. Um. Oh! There she is! <gasps> She's cool. Oh, we're both witches! <laughs> um, 
Yeah. I mean, if I could, like, get one as a gift or afford one, sure, I would like one. But for now, it's okay. Plus, when I travel, I do take my laptop with me. I'm not fun of Switch games, so I don't really have need to own a Switch. Fair, that makes sense. Um, for me, there's so many, like... So many. Um... Though some of those games I have on PC or are on PC as well. So you could say, like, why don't you get it on PC? It's just certain games I want to play while I'm cozied up in bed or on the couch with a blanket and, like, you know. Um, so that's why. Also, I travel to my family regularly. Especially, like, um, I got that Switch in 2021. And in 2022, I traveled so much um, back and forth that it was perfect timing for me to get it because I could, you know, play. Um, I I played the shit out of The Witcher. I have only have Zelda and several Pokemon. I don't have any Zelda game. I would love to get some Zelda games. But I have so many that I don't really need it. I think, like... I still haven't finished The Witcher 3, so I should do that. Um, and the next, like, RPG-like game that I have is um, Dragon Quest XI. Um, so, I don't really need another RPG um, anytime soon, I think. I have so many games on the Switch, it's ridiculous. Anyway. <sighs> I almost fell asleep waiting. <laughs> As usual, my predictions are correct. What? You 